What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to Big Bro and Losis Reacts. I'm Tamaj and this is Diane. Hey, oh my gosh. Look at that shirt. Oh, with a green arrow on the flash. Hey. But that was totally unplanned, by the way. Yeah. But um, we are on Superman and Lois, Season 2, Episode 10, Bizarros in a Bizarro World. So we're back after 30 days and 30 nights, pun intended. Uh, that was the title of the last episode. Oh. CW made us wait all this damn time for another episode, but we're finally back. And I'm pretty sure they're going to have another break because the season finale ain't until June. And there's only, what, six episodes left, including this one. So we're going to have another break at least. Um, not a long one, thankfully. Um, but, yeah, I'm excited to get into this. Um, John's doppelganger from the Bizarre World popped up at the Kent house. Um, so I think we're going to get an explanation from him. I, like I said in the last video, I think he's going to help our John get his powers. Um, and we'll probably see what was Clark's been doing in those 30 days over there and why he's stuck. Um, but I'm ready to get into it. Foreigner, the reactions are available on Patreon. Let's do it. Right to it. Oh, not the bizarro symbol. What? Um, what did he do to his suit? These are all the people that went through their dad. Yeah. Anderson's dad? Please. Thank you. The writers understood that assignment. <laughs> you better get on the ground, sir. Not a square earth. Okay, it, it is real bizarro over here. Um, hero. Of the rise, the rise and of fall of our hero. Yeah. Oh, it's like in the mind. Did he send you? My son? Hey, old guy's gone. Not exactly. of this earth i have to before she merges she with has both pendants i believe so and the ally of my world is here as well and it is only a matter of time before she becomes the most powerful being on this planet the rest of the world will have no choice either merge or die it is simply not possible for humans to coexist with beings of that magnitude what was that John, we'll take this with us, all right? Allie Alston knows you're here. How is that possible? I'll explain later. We need to get to the farm. It's the safest place to hide out. Until we come up with a plan, at least. You can fly. Do a lot more than that. That's dope. Flies that I can't wait for our John to get like that. How'd you know I was here? Well, your face is plastered on every TV in the world right now. Allie's followers have total control of the media. Check it out. Why is you face must immediately out? report any sighting of this Plutonian fugitive. The ascension is nearly upon us, my friends. And on that day, I will show the world how it feels to become whole. How long has she been? An hour? A few months? She's clearly haven't uh, kept up on the place. She saw that the world was broken, and she just she, she took advantage. She made people believe that there was an easy way to fix everything. And people just willingly followed her? At first, yeah. How do we find her? My guess is she sold the DOD. The DOD? Yeah, she and her people took it over. She has both pendants and her other self. The best place to merge would be somewhere where no one can get inside. Except 
You and me. That seems like a suicide run, but. What are you looking for? Something to help you power up. Feels like you need it, no? Yeah, I knew my dad would have some kryptonite here somewhere. I'm not sure that's such a good idea. You have more strength than my dad, I guess. I, I assume you met him when he escaped the Earth to be a hero again? I did, yes. And why didn't he come back with you? He's dead, isn't he? I knew he'd fail. You forgot what it was to be a hero a long time ago. I think he was just trying to fix all the wrong. There's no fixing that. Not with me. The two of you take it alone? Yeah, let's, let's just say that we didn't exactly see eye to eye on some decisions I made. It's his way of the skyway, you know? You know, sometimes parents, they, um, they can get stuck in their ways. But I'm sure he just wanted what was best for you. Did he even mention I existed? Well, he didn't really have a chance. Yeah, because he didn't care. Yes, he did, Jonathan. Mm. More than you'll ever know. He loved you. Enough! You didn't disappear like I told you to. I'm not gonna talk to his mama like that. Bizarro Jonathan. Okay, we're here. How long do we have to stay at this thing? An hour, maybe two. There it's that hair for me. Which way is that? I need to see their story and how this Superman got all physically messed up and zombified. But that's one of his tapes. Instead of being hidden, really he's like famous. Uh, His identity is public. Yeah. He he's so oblivious because he's so. into the crowd. Looks like Jonathan finally got his powers. This complicates things. It's perfect. You can finally see what I deal with on a daily basis. What are you suggesting we let our 15 year old son be a hero? With my guidance. He only goes on missions with me. That way I can show him what is that. Have you thought of a name for me to give the press? Oh, uh. What, what about Superboy? <laughs> no. Seriously trying to embarrass me right now? I like it. Just John L., son of Cowell. So far in the world knows that the elves are a family of heroes. Well, most of the elves. He's just teasing. Your powers are going to come in any day now. It's mm. great that you're carrying really the family. really is opposite here. But you might want to think of a way to make yourself stand out from your dad. So weird. They're so oh. open and free, and our Clarks are just, you know, trapped by their secrets. It's crazy. Come on now. Y'all know that don't work. That's embarrassing. I don't even know why they try. I would not try Superman in his own city. And then come in with some little machine guns, sir. If it ain't got kryptonite bullets, what is it really doing? Y'all are better off going to get you a 9 to 5 and make or something. Like, I mean, if you that broke that you got to rob somebody, you ain't too good for McDonald's. I wouldn't work that bad. I ain't trying to rob my bags. So y'all just wasn't going to break? <laughs> like, what are we doing? Like, whose truck is bigger than news? Like, who's stronger? Like, what, what y'all doing here? Why y'all in the same lane? We've talked about this. Nobody's asking questions. Relax, all right? It was a simple accident. I don't, I don't need dad's help. That's not the point. Yeah, but it kind of is, though. You are barely 15. Yeah, well, I'm not 15. That's not the point. Yeah, but it kind of is, though. You are barely 15. That is not your call to make. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that that unicorn left the bar and as soon as the world saw what I could do. I am your father. You do what I tell you to do. You understand? Oh, so so now you want to be my dad now that I have powers. Where were you before? <laughs> Don't you take that tone in me. You know exactly where I was. Actually, yeah, yeah, I do. Uh, selling your shoe line and hosting Kevin's. Oh, and, and the trips with President Seinfeld. I have responsibilities, Jonathan. I thought by now you would understand that. That's the thing, Dad. It's always, always about me understanding you. Maybe for once in your life, 
You should think about how I'm feeling. Yeah, he is very Jonathan, selfish. Can we please just talk about this? Forget it. But I'm here now, Jonathan. Well, it's not always about you, pops. <laughs> Not the Warner Bros. logo. No, I'm dead. That's just like I mean, do you even know? Water tower. No, what? Uh, who you are? There's someone I'd like you to meet. It's nice to finally meet you. The lady behind those uprisings in Star City. A simple misunderstanding. It's not See, all of it and die on this earth to make peace in Star City. There's something that I would like to show you. Something that would change. Everything that you think you know about yourself. Sure. Why not? Fix Jonathan a cup of tea. Mm mm. I'm drink the tea. <laughs> Enough! You disappeared like I told you to. Don't tell him anything. He's working for Adam. Jonathan. Played us. You're gonna tell me where I can find those pendants. Because I've had enough, I can't live like oh, this, Cal. Oh, this is, this is present dad. Yeah. You can't just take our son. When they, we, yeah, they, they flash back. I tried to make this work. I really did, but you refused to take. Oh, that's not true. That, I hardly go out anymore. I cut back on the press. You should have cut all of it. The interviews, the, the galas, the calendar shoots. How many times have I Calendars. told you? It's part of the job. And the crib tonight? Is that part of the job, too? It's making me better. It's okay? making you crazy. All you do, day and night, it's flying around the world and never ends. I'm a superhero, Lois. I go where people need me. We need you, damn it. Jordan and I, we need you just like Jonathan did. I can't just stop saving people. That is not what I'm saying. Cal, I don't blame you for all of this. I am just as responsible for what happened as you are. But Jonathan never felt heard or seen, and it turned him into somebody I can hardly recognize. I'm not gonna let that happen again. She left her. Everything you had was never here. Lois. This life, this family, all of it was me! This part did you. His office like he's angry. Ah! I get it, it's all opposite. Ain't nothing. That's what I said happened to the bottom. Sorry to burn you. It's a mess. Nothing's more it's important than square. my daughters. She's recruiting political agitators, ex military, people with powers. We're going to stop her, Lois. And then we're going to get John out of that damn cult. What's happening? It's your grandson. Oh. Die. Lana! Project 4377, where is it? You're trying to keep your father from like that? Alley where is it? You're not giving my ex case, huh? If you don't give it to us, I will freeze all the skin off your face in general. Mayor, please! Jonathan, that void that you feel, the one that you think Allie's gonna magically fill by helping you become someone new, that's not there because there's something wrong with you. Where's 4377? We never taught it's you like her, her talking to her sister. Life. It's not magazine covers or talk shows or some signature move. Last chance, Gramps. Tell me right now. Sorry, I wasn't a better mother. I know that I failed you. I won't anymore. Please just come back to us. I thought these three were smarter than your father. Right. Rosetti, follow me. Yeah, Mo. You son of a bitch. He wanted to see if they would comply. If you're not going to join us, then disappear. Allie found a portal to another Earth. If she merges with herself, no military will be able to stop her. This would be the end of humanity as we know it. So, how do we get to Allie before that happens? We can't. Well, I can't. Let's look to me. You were right, Lois. I was never there. What about her? So you were you? Taking the kryptonite, that's what happened to him? I always got a small army at the DOD. Most of which is hopped up on kryptonite. And you're... You're not as strong as you once were. Run to me. 
fucking with the DOT. Take a bed. I'll make it to the other right. Or I can destroy the forbidden. I have to save our son. It's the last thing I do. I'm so sorry. For everything. You're gonna tell me where I can find those pendants. Sure, I did. Ooh. God damn. He's like, this is my goddamn earth. Tell me where Emerson is now. What? Where are they? Where are the pendants? Stop it! I don't know. Please! You're gonna tell me where Imagine you mean it by your own son. Like my dad. Right here. Yeah. But who was that? Anderson? Yeah. This is this Earth Anderson now, ain't it? What is he saying? I don't know. But it looks like she needs help. Did he merge with himself? Right, because you can't be with your other self or her. He has both pendants. What are you two playing at? Excuse me. Where is my other half? Neither of us would ever willingly give up our pendants. Where is she? I don't look like that. What's a fish? It's a trick. I want those pendants. Oh. Uh, he said, Bitch, please. <laughs> you tell me he had powers. I did not. Ali. Ali, what do I do? Take him out. Now, Why is he so hesitant? This version's of Anderson that died, okay. I've shown you all before. Well, first time for everything, right? He won't be able to hide for long. I'm surprised he can just kill him or something. Send any luck with that Luther piece? Not the Luther piece? Janet? Boss, I have never seen anything like this. Definitely the opposite. She actually got some staff. This guy's face is plastered across every website I've tried. Who is he? Man, Sue Man, Sue they were used to speaking Oh, great. He's insane. Well, this is a different language. He's just speaking a different language. Say, boys. We're backwards. Lois, no one's seen her since the DOD was taken. Miss Beppel, Ali's demanding that anyone with information on his whereabouts come forward immediately. If you don't say that out loud. Here and we didn't say anything, we're all dead. Please, you need to leave. We need to hurry. Sir, do, do you know what happened to my dad? He, he went to your world. Dad. Uh, well, dad backwards is dad, dad, so. My dad. Might be the only word he can understand, dad and mom. Yep, he just figured out Superman's identity. He was awesome. Yeah. No, no. What does that mean? What does that mean? Why is what Anderson mean? so mean? I don't get it. You were so power hungry and almighty on our earth. Now you over here, you just a mess. Maybe. He just didn't realize what he was getting himself into. <laughs> Just getting tossed around this episode. You are right. Now you on our side. And this is all your goddamn fault. I can't stand it. You brought me here to keep the pendants safe. I know they ain't duct tape them like that. We're gonna do something. Help me heal. I doubt. 
I don't think that dampened power is the worst. I don't think Justin's anymore. How many neighbors do you have left? I thought she was our award on our earth and made him stronger. Maybe it's enough to get you back to the portal alive. After everything that I've done, you would still try and save me. I've told you before. To me, everyone's worth saving. I thought coming here would prove that you and the other Superman were the bad guys. But instead, it was Allie and me. How could I be so wrong? Yeah, asshole. That's your family on Earth, too. And the reason that you kept things from me was to protect them. Yes. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Superman is so much better. Out here. Sorry, I ain't do a bitch you did. But right now we need him. He's strong. Great. Uh, of course. Power row, Lana, and both right. the alleys. Okay, give it to Clark. Don't let him get these. This is all we've got. Stay here. It sucks that this John over here is bad and he ended up on our earth with this Clark's family. Our there? Clark's family. My brother, as he once was. Those belong to us, and you're going to give them back. This isn't the way to save people. And who makes that decision for us, Superman? You? The two of us, together, we're going to give everyone the power to become their own people. Am I merging the people of this world into those of mine? Two halves to make a whole. People are not halves. You can't just eliminate a population. Maybe, we're not for eliminating. A we're combining the best of both. Well, they just said her Dependent. family was special, right? Now. Yeah. We've got to help. We should have stayed hidden. He still loves them, otherwise he would hurt them. Get back to our earth. Well, we still got two other superpower folks. Yeah, there you go. Woohoo! See you later. Went all the way to Texas. Damn! Um, I thought that was Clark. He took his seven. Yep, gut okay. punch, baby. Bitch. Hi. <laughs> the way they be getting tossed this episode. God damn it, brother. I'm sorry, Clark, but you gotta kill him. Clark ain't killing that one. You know that. I know. But damn. damn. We are so outnumbered. And Clark. Did our Jordan get powers yet? I mean, not our Jordan, Jordan but their Jordan. Did he get powers yet here? Because we could use him. Level the playing field for sure. He's the only one who ain't gotten like a flashback. Damn. Is he dead? It's that crit in his chest. I know, that's why his mouth started bleeding. He probably just killed it. Heroes of this earth. Where is what's his name? The Zaro Tower. I'm just gonna have to tell you. Uh -huh. This is about hosting the ESPYs again. Cool, but. Our jokes were square. Jerk, and clearly. Uh, this no is the little thing. I'm living in Uncle's! The rest of the night, the drinks are on me. I got a lot of thirsty customers taking you up on your offer. I'm gonna need a credit card. I promise you I'm good for it. I wouldn't be so sure about that. It's not like I don't know who you are. World's most eligible bachelor. Don't believe everything you read in Persons magazine. I'm, um, I'm simply a guy who hasn't found the right woman yet. Maybe that's because you've never been a small girl. She's too good for me. 
That's true. Maybe this is a mistake. No, you're just nervous. You and Lana are the happiest couple I know. Okay, I he wore his, uh... This changes nothing between to us. his wedding and will always be my brother. Suit and tie. Whatever you need. I guess he just wanted to represent his family and, like, got married. His shoes! I like the dress, though. I feel it was a little longer. <sighs> Lois and Jordan aren't coming back. Once I stop Elios, Cal. Once I stop her and get Jonathan back, Lois will come back too. Don't you feel that that something is missing? Have you been listening? Mm -hmm. Jonathan arranged a meeting. How could you do that? Lana and I agreed there was some truth in what she had to say. Tom, you should be listening to me. Don't get involved with that woman, please. She's dangerous. Cal, I think she could help you. No, you promised me. You promised if I, if I needed something, anything, you would do whatever I asked. Do you remember that? Yes, of course. I, I'm asking you to walk away. He is truly lost. Give me your word. Give me your word. You will walk away. Will you walk away from me? Cal, please. I'm your brother. You don't have to do this. I mean, he did part. Clark drove his own family away here. What is she becoming? I don't even want to know. How she just all of a sudden able to stop somebody at super speed? Come on. How she know he was even about to attack? He's about to try to merge with our John. That's why he came. Oh fuck. You know, I don't know if he likes that. I failed my brother once before. Seeing you here reminds me of what I lost. Oh. Your own wife? Save yourself. I was gonna say the only other hope we have on our earth is Jordan, but he's not. Anywhere on this John's level, Bizarro John will wipe the floor with our John. I mean, our Jordan. Oh. Yes, Clark, make it back. Is the episode over? Come on. Uh, this up. Oh wait, okay. You got another scene. Okay. Hey, look, John's home. Is he okay? Probably not. Why are you here? That was even worse of an ending. Damn. They weren't gonna give me what I wanted. Clark gonna show up though and save his, his son. But wow. Best episode of the season, he thinks? For sure. I think this was the best episode. It literally told the entire story just from the different the perspective. Episodes. But yeah, I told this one. I think this was the best. It, it really literally retold the whole plot just from the bizarre perspective. And, and it it did a great job of developing every character over there except Bizarro Jordan, which maybe that might still come. Maybe they just wanted to give his side of the uh, story for another episode. Um, but that was, yeah, I, I, I can understand everybody's motivations now. Like, I finally understand everybody. I really um, thought it was like on opposite plane it was like jordan yeah jordan was the only one who survived wait the one with powers on the opposite place is jordan right john jonathan whatever jonathan on the opposite plane he's on our earth now but yeah jonathan i really thought it was where um jordan and his mom died and jonathan was the only one alive and Whatever her name is, killed the rest of the Clark's family, and that's what drove him crazy. But yeah, I didn't think he drove himself crazy. Yeah, that was because it was like when we first got over there, or when it first showed it, like the the pictures were crossed out, so it makes it seem like they were dead. But yeah. John just had did it because he he considered his family dead to him. 
So they left because um, he felt really ignored and neglected. And maybe that's what would have happened to our Jordan had things not gone so well for him. Had Clark not, you know, refocused his attention to his family. Because it was going that way for a while. You know, Jordan was real depressed and feeling how this John was feeling, um, Bizarro John was feeling. And it just goes to show that the, the Earths were real similar. It's just one Clark was like kind of selfish and, you know, was too caught up in the fame and, you know, being a hero versus our Clark. He kept to himself. He's humble. He, you know, realized that his family needed him a bit more. So he came over. He still does his whole Superman thing, but he makes sure to come home at the end of the day and be a dad 100%. So I think, yeah, our Clark definitely got it right. He's the perfect Superman. Um, as well as perfect as he can be. Um, really good. Um, um well, their Lois over there, I feel like she probably wasn't as vocal and as stern as our Lois. Like, our Lois, she don't They're give no like, shit. She has no filter. Whoop. She gonna tell you how she feels at the end of the day. And she gonna get you, you know, she gonna get you right. So, she, I don't think that Lois over there, she didn't really speak her truth until it was too late, until she was ready to go. When in reality, she should have been spoken. And maybe she did, but she didn't make it as clear, clearly, you know. And so, you know, and then he, but he was also off of, you know, the kryptonite. So he was starting to deteriorate, um, which also was kind of like a nod to like, if our Jonathan on our earth keeps using that ex kryptonite, that could be what happens to him. Oh, yeah. And he starts to go crazy and deteriorate. So he definitely has to stop using that. I he hope he was getting angrier. Mm -hmm, it was changing him, but I, I, I hope that he naturally starts to get powers. I mean, he's, he doesn't have any supply now. I don't think anyway. So our Jonathan can't do it know, even if he wanted to. Uh, well, he had it, but he was also, I mean, he was famous, so he, if, you know, he could probably get whatever he wants. You know, everybody loved him. Um, plus, he was working with Allie and all of them, so they can get whatever they want, literally. They were, at the, they were at the DOD. They had control of the DOD. They can get whatever they want. They were running that earth, pretty much. Um, that's why I was like, dang, ain't no other heroes on this earth. Can't nobody help them? Nothing. Like, literally, that world revolves around the supers. Yeah, I don't Car is on that earth, though. Probably not. Because, listen, because... Or if it's opposite, Car is on that earth but never came out of Supergirl. Didn't use her powers. Uh, and maybe they just... Yeah, and she didn't, like, save Car for sake or anything. Because if it was, and she was like, oh, I'm Car Danvers, I'm Supergirl. They would be like, oh, Clark, you're... Because, well, yeah, they can have fear. I mean, there's it, since it's a different Earth, it literally could have any, you know, different story. Opposite can mean a, a lot of different things. It could have just meant she died. It could have meant she her pod never made it out the Phantom Zone. It could have meant she came here and never became Supergirl. It could mean a, a lot of different things. There could be a lot of opposite versions of her, you know. So there's there's really no way unless they tell us the story. Um, but this episode, like, there was just so much to dissect. Like their lives are just so. Nice. crazy and it's so hard to decipher like who's a good person and who's a bad person like Jonathan right i didn't i thought yeah he, he was just playing us from the start like you know you don't because our jo our jonathan is a good person so you don't naturally want to believe that on on, on different earth he'd be any different right. you know because we thought that of bizarro we thought when he came over he was a bad, bad person but he really had good intention he was just kind of crazy and so desperate from what he had lost and he was so desperate to try and stop Allie to get his family back that he kind of blinded himself and like kind of pushed out any help at first. And That's... so it made him seem like a bad person. Mm -hmm. So had he been in his right mind, he could have worked with our Superman. We could have prevented Anderson, our Anderson from doing all this and everything. He pissed me off too. Cause like now you want to flip flop after you feel like you was wrong. But why did you feel like our Superman had to be, was a bad person? He's literally the most humble like American superhero that, you know, as it comes, like he, he literally told you, you know, I'm going to protect the world. You know, I'm going to do this and that. He always, you know, he tried to work with you and everything, but for some reason you just kept viewing him as a bad guy. Like, I don't understand just that. Just because he was helping other countries. Right. So he the went. The world don't evolve around America. Like, so he went over there hoping that Superman would be evil over there so that he had some sort of justification. So now he didn't get it. Now you fucked everybody else over. Like. I, I just and you want to try yeah, to make things right, up but it's too all late. All these people lied. He just whatever. He just gave Allie everything she wanted. 
<laughs> and so like now I can't even Anderson's yeah. no longer the villain. But it was good writing because I just knew he was going towards being a villain and then like just like they keep playing with your expectations. Like we thought Bizarre was gonna be a villain. Nope. He ended up dying and actually being just somebody who was really broken. But when we got Anderson, you kind of led him towards the villain path, but he kind of saw the error of his ways. Well, now he's out of the equation. Now we're stuck with Allie, the ultimate villain. Um, and she's, I guess, now merging. So she's going to be all powerful. I don't even know what that means, what that looks like, how they're going to stop her. She looks normal. Yeah. I guess I'm just happy that our Clark is back on our earth and I guess we just got to come up with a plan. I, I don't know what that would be because we're still outnumbered because they have all these super power Kryptonians over there. Lana, well, we got Tal Rao, but he didn't come. So I don't know. They'll probably have, kill him. What's his name in the suit? Well, we have John Henry on our earth, but he can't stand up to no Kryptonian. Um, Not really. I mean, we have X kryptonite on this earth, so that could be used to weaken them. Plus, our yellow sun weakens them if they do come over here and try something. But I don't know. We may have to go back over there if Allie doesn't come back. So I don't know. I don't know where they're going to take this. I really don't. But the story is really good. This, like I said, in my opinion, was the best episode. This just, just, I love, it's always fun seeing different versions of the characters and how their lives could have been. It's just so fun. Um, the acting, I didn't get to say it, but the acting was top notch. Oh, like yeah. they killed it. The whole cast killed it. I'm glad they utilized they every are character. They are the characters. Like they fit the characters so well. Each version of them, I loved it. I, I, I they did amazing with picking out who was gonna play his part. Mm -hmm. And it's just so fun to see them in opposite roles, like good and evil, and you know different powers. Oh. And they really like the attention to detail, with just like everything being opposite and backwards. Square earth, square, you know, pool table pieces. Like, everything was just great. Like, I loved it. It was um, so different seeing Lana, like, evil. Yeah. She didn't get a family over there, so she just, yeah. I guess, became cold. Her but. dress on a, the flip side was prettier than her, actually. I'm dead. It just wish it was longer. Just Hopefully we get to see more of that side, though. Like I said, I want to also dive into Bizarro yeah. Jordan. Um, but... Thank you guys for watching, and of course, we want to hear what you guys thought. Be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, subscribe to the channel for it. And we'll see you guys for more Superman and Lois. Bye.